Hey guys, your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome, guys. This is the last one for the road, and then I'm packing it up because I got stick up. All right, guys, I have to deep dive and do some searching on the internet like everybody else. All right, guys, what is going on? We're using the shush deck again because I don't feel like pulling anything else out right now. So maybe this is what's supposed to be or to come out. What are their secrets, if any? I judged you and me. They was worried about the opinion of others. The hell? Maybe they more worried about themselves, right? What you, what you gonna say about me? What you gonna say about me, okay? All right. How do I tell my spouse I met and fell in love with my best friend? Okay, that's why they're going to feel judged. Because this person's married. Maybe they're going to feel like people are going to say something and this and that. I don't know. To each his own. Small forward, you were my second choice. Of course, of course, you was married. Right? Maybe the person you was dating didn't know that. But they know now. One more spirit. Every day was a lie. I never told the truth, too afraid of the outcome. Well, look at you now. Look at you now, right? Simple Simon. Simple Simon. Simple Simon. This fell on the floor. I felt bad for the person I had to leave, making things much harder. Wow. People be living, don't they, with some burden? Mm-hmm. Actually, let me switch the deck up. Let's do this one. Let's do this puppy right here and see if it barks, okay? I just saw 202. I just saw 202, guys, okay? If I can remember, I'll look it up. Maybe it's people that live in D.C., right? Isn't 202 D.C.? That area? I mean, you can be living anywhere now, but it it, um, it's com it comes from a D.C. It's a D.C area code holy spirit what's going on page of cups i judged you and me they still want to offer you this love though they still want to offer you make you a love offer king of cups in, in reverse how do i tell my spouse i met and fell in love with my best friend so they want to offer you love they aren't in love with their person anymore king of cups in reverse They're frustrated because they made you their second choice. They're frustrated because you were their small forward. Uh, whatever. Holy Spirit. Six of Wands. They can probably see victory with you. You know, you could be someone who's in the public eye as well. Maybe you have support behind you. The Six of Wands is like the victory card. They always have a crowd behind them cheering them on. And the Wheel of Fortune. They felt bad for the person uh, that they had to leave, making things harder. But they can see the wheel of fortune with you, right? They can see good things with you. Happy times, you know, building, whatever. It's a knight of wands in reverse. So they cheated with you. They did. They cheated with you and on their spouse. Holy Spirit. And they're thinking about leaving their spouse with the chariot here. They're thinking about leaving their person. <laughs> The tower is in reverse. Maybe they want to come back and try to build things with you. They're definitely frustrated that they're not with you. You make them happy. They can see victory with you. There's the sun card there. You make them happy. Every day was a lie. Every day was a lie. They want you back. Ten of swords in reverse. They could also have a fear of change, but sometimes they want to upright that uh, backstabbing, right? Page of Pentacles. They're definitely thinking about moving on, guys. This person that cheated with you and fell in love. And then fell in love with you and made you their best friend. Chariot. They're moving on. They're being real sneaky. Their person don't even know they're about to leave. But if they have that conversation, they're going to know. Um, tower in reverse. They want you back. I told you. Death card in reverse. Ten of swords in reverse. Tower card in reverse. They want to rebuild. 
they're moving on guys four cups in reverse they're not going to allow this to stop them they want to come forward they definitely been through their judgment this person wants you back holy spirit clarify how do i tell my spouse i met and fell in love with my best friend let's see if the cards let's see if the cards can give you some advice right ten of pentacles in reverse guys they're ooh. spirit clarify the ten of pentacles in reverse and I say be honest. Be honest to this person so they can decide what they want to do with their life, right? Eight of Pentacles in reverse. They're not putting in any more work there. Spirit, clarify every day was a lie. Their hermit is in reverse. So they're they're very quiet, but they're choosing not to say anything about anything. Trying to follow their intuition. Holy Spirit, they felt bad for the person they had to leave, making things much harder. Clarify. It's causing problems, five of wands. They knew it would hurt them. It would cause fights, this and that. King of Wands in reverse. They wasn't making decisions for themselves or standing up for themselves. Anything like that. They have options. They know they need to choose wisely. Spirit, clarify this page of cups here. Eight of Wands in reverse. They're not doing anything. They they have some delays or whatever, but they do want to take this leap of faith. They want to do it again. King of Cups in reverse. You're not happy, boo-boo. You're not happy. They're not following their intuition. You better speak your truth or forever hold your peace. <laughs> Because you're going to be unhappy. I mean, if you're with someone that you, you don't want to be with, I'm not saying leave your person, but damn, you can't be unhappy, right? That that just makes for a really crappy life. They can see that you're reaping rewards from your past or whatever you're doing. And they're ready to change. Maybe they're reaping rewards from their past. Spirit, clarify the Six of Wands. Nine of Pentacles. They can see victory with you, or maybe you have victory with the Nine of Pentacles, single and abundant. They're trying to heal their heart. They can see you've healed your heart, you know, for by them walking away, and you just kept going. Holy Spirit. Six of Pentacles. They want to balance things with you. They think being with you will be an equal give and take. They're walking away. Three of Wands. Holy Spirit. Clarify this chariot. Where are you going, person? They still have fear, though. They have a fear of change. Six of swords in reverse. But they're slowly, you know, gaining momentum with this Knight of Pentacles here. Tower card in reverse. Knight of swords. They're going to rush in. They're going to rush in as fast as they can. Because you're their son. You're their happiness. They want a new beginning with you. They want another chance. Ace of Pentacles. I told you, this person wants you back. They're not losing sleep over this anymore. They're not having bad dreams. They're not holding on to any type of fear. They're standing in their strength. Guys, be ready. Holy Spirit. Page of Pentacles. They want a new beginning with you. Ace of Wands. They're being very sneaky. Seven of Swords energy. They're going to try to sneak back into your life. Because you're their wish fulfillment. You're their nine of cups. They want to make things right with you. Justice card. This person wants you back. They want you back. They're about to leave somebody out in the cold. And it's about to be cold. So it's about to be winter time. Five of pentacles. Two of cups in reverse. Yeah, they're coming. Four of cups in reverse. They want the past back. They're, it's not going to stop them from getting to the past. And look what's on the bottom. Ten of Cups. Then we have the Queen of Pentacles here. This person is burdened. They're up in their head. Mm. Holy Spirit. What is the outcome here? What is this person going to do? They're going to release the devil. Get that devil up off their back. Get that fear off their back. They're not in hangman anymore. Maybe they know what they need to do. Maybe they know. It's betrayal here. They feel bad. Maybe they feel bad for betraying their person. But they're standing in their spot. That's the emperor. 
it's over. The world is in reverse. They're leaving that person. Spirit clarify the five of swords. They're hopeful. Even though they know they betrayed you and they betrayed their spouse, I think they're worried more about you than their spouse. They're healing. I guess they said this person just going to have to heal. They want things to work with you. Three of Pentacles, Hierophant, and Reverse. They're ending things. You their lover. They manifesting you back. They want to celebrate with you and be married. And then here's the eight of freaking mother effing cups. They're walking away. They feel like nothing else could be done here. And you know what, guys? You know, four wands. Jeez Louise. Being persistent. There's the ace of cups. This person is in love. Knight of cups. I can't. I can't. And they regret. They regret having to do this. But they're not going to let that hold them back. They want balance in their life. It may leave the other person up in their head, though. Queen of Cups in reverse. This person is definitely unhappy that this person's moving on. Going through this Queen of Wands. Page of Swords. They could have been watching you. Impress. You better stop. They got clarity on how they feel about you guys. It's leaving somebody else up in their head, though. They feel manipulated. It's the King of Pentacles that's coming for you. And then we have Queen of Swords. Standing in their power. Making decisions for themselves. This is actually sad. Because. They are married. Right? And. They cheated with you. You probably didn't know they was married. Some of you do. But they fell in love with you. They feel like you're their best friend. And that's huge. I mean. Yes you can be married. But when someone is your best friend. Sometimes. I don't want to say it's deeper than marriage. It's not. But that best friend. That's pretty damn deep. It's like, y'all know what best friends are. It's just different. It's on a different level. Like if they married you, then they, I married my best friend. You know what I mean? That's really deep. So they've been fighting with themselves, guys. They probably tried to fix things with their spouse, but they couldn't get over you. And now they're going to tell this person. It looks like they're leaving them. They want you back. They're fighting with themselves. And my thing is, be honest. Tell your person. You don't have to tell them that you leave them for somebody else. I don't know how you're going to tell them. But you need to be honest to your spouse because it's unfair to them, especially if your heart is elsewhere. So they need to know so they can decide what they're going to do with their life and how they're going to go forward, right? It's, it's, it's not fair because this person here is clearly in love with someone else. They're in love with their best friend. I met and fell in love with my best friend. That's pretty damn deep. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Good night. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.